hello friends welcome back to the channel today we are going to learn how to use sparklines to visualize sales data let's get started great first of all let's understand about sparklines sparklines are a tiny chart that fit within single cell to give you a quick visual snapshot of your data trends in simple terms, we can display data in graphical chart in a single cell. For example, we have sales figures for five products over six months. Now let's add sparklines to see trends for each product. Select the cell where you like to insert sparklines. For product A, let me choose I4. Go to insert tab. In spark lines we have three type of charts first one is line for chart lines second one is column for bar charts and next one is win or loss for win and loss charts for this scenario i'm going to use line chart create spark lines dialog box will pop up where we have to select data range now select data range for one product click ok here you will see a small line chart appear in cell I4. This is the sparkline chart. We need not to create sparkline for each product manually. Just drag and drop. This is the basic level of sparkline chart. So whenever we change any of the value here, this will get changed automatically. Let's change 70 here and 100 so whenever we change value chart will get changed based on value also we can customize to make it look better click on sparkline to activate the sparkline tool just go to sparkline tab here we have a lot of options to customize our chart first one is sparkline here we can edit specific data or line chart to change entire data select first one here we can change month or range of data to get sales value for particular set of month here i'm going to skip june month so this will get changed for five months okay let me undo it because we need all the data for six months to change specific product, just you can select single sparkling data to amend for particular data. In this scenario, we have selected six months, but if you like to skip any of the month, just you can select three months, four months like that to change data for particular range of data. Okay, let me undo it because we need a six months date. Next one is type. So here we have three options. First one is line, second one is column to change chart type or we can use win and loss also let me choose line and in the show we have a lot of options like if we like to add any pointer or marker you may select high point to indicate high point in the chart or trend line if you like to add low points just you may select low point here and first point last point or markers or negative points so based on our requirements we may select any of the markers in show in the style you can change any of the style format or colors for sparklines this will get changed next one is sparkling color so if you like to change this color because in default it will be in a blue color if you like to change just click sparkling color to change different color set and in the marker color you may select high point low point or any of the point indicator with a different set of colors in access we have a lot of options to customize data in more detailed aspects next one is group or ungroup so this is a set of a group which we have now so if you like to ungroup just click on ungroup each sparkling will be separate from the group 
if you like to clear spark client just click clear there are two options to clear specific cell data or chart line just click clear selected spark lines to remove all of them just select the second one to remove all charts from this list just select go to clear clear selected sparkline groups so in this method you can create sparklines to show data in visual format if you like this video press like button and don't forget to hit subscribe button for more videos see you soon.